Hi Capricorn, welcome back to my channel. This is Enigma and you're watching I Enigma. We're going to do your Feb 15 to 21 read. Let's see the messages for you. This is going to be a general reading. So take what resonates and what does not resonate. For more personals and accuracy, reach out on WhatsApp, Instagram and email. Details are given down below. And I also do white prairie spells and manifestation crystals which are high vibrational intention charge pure crystals. I'll charge it for you if you, can, if you want to get it from me. Do check out more stuff on my Instagram and subscribe to this channel for more videos on your site. <clears throat> Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment and uh, share in the end. Okay, Capricorn, let's see the messages. Sun, Moon, Rising, Arena, Science of Capricorn. Give me messages for you all. <clears throat> Wow, Capricorn, you're very much in love with yourself right now. I feel like you're dealing with the past hurt and you're coming out of it. You were stuck <clears throat> in a third party situation. This person was uh, dealing with you and the other party and you were not able to come out of it. This, this third party situation that this person was keeping you in you knew it, but it was hard for you to come out of it. It felt like the key is not in your hand. To keep the control of your life is not in your hand. That's what you felt, Capricorn. <clears throat> I feel like things have started to change slowly, but they're changing. You've started to love yourself, respect yourself and your own needs. You know what is not going to work out for you is nothing to be worried about of losing you're letting go of something that is not working out for you in the end of the day <clears throat> with the nine of pentacles i'm seeing you loving yourself way beyond um you know anyone's expectation or your own expectation you started to you know grow in such a way that what you saw is actually turning into a beautiful full grown flower it's like whatever you saw is actually the results are in your favor you are getting those results you are becoming happier successful and you're feeling confident and you're feeling like you also feel like your feet are not on the ground it's it's so beautiful the energy around you capricorn you're simply loving the life that you're you're having you you're playing solo for some of you are playing solo and you're literally enjoying if you're in a relationship you just want some space and i feel that space is really important to <clears throat> energize yourself walking barefoot on grass is something that's going to make you feel more earthed and more grounded and happier so yeah i feel like you're just diving deep into your own emotions and loving and knowing what you want and doing what you want and that is why you're getting your wishes manifested everything you're doing in your favor is turning into a beautiful reality the sun so you're getting success in your pursuit whatever you're working on you might be going for a higher study or you might be beautifying yourself making your uh, self look beautiful attractive or feel good inside you know <clears throat> you have friends circle that really cares for you and supports you so you're happy wherever you are there's success that you're getting okay whatever you're focusing your positive like whatever positive you're focusing your energy on you're getting success in it and that makes you feel uh, good and that makes you feel more distracted from the past hurt <clears throat> i feel you're dealing with a pisces someone i feel like from the past is still wanting to get hold of you uh, is still feeling like they're waiting on you and they know that they cheated they may have put you in this third party situation but they don't want this ending to happen however you've you've dealt with it you're done with it and you're not giving this person another chance <clears throat> queen of pentacles is you becoming more proud in your in your position in your work you've laid a solid foundation for yourself i feel like you're getting richer day by day capricorn whatever you're doing you've putting your hard work into it you're sowing the seed of 
you know growth and you're getting there you're becoming slowly you're reaching that point of that peak of success you're feeling grounded money is something that's actually growing okay actually growing you will be traveling a lot uh, for your work or for the opportunities and you will get good result there will be situations hard situations for you but you're going to <clears throat> climb those obstacles with such ease that you would never have any moment where you're feeling like this is a challenge or this is giving me hurt this is this is wounding me or this gives me trauma of some kind no you are being careful in your pursuit to your dreams to your passion whatever you want to achieve in your life you're moving fast but you're also careful about your movement so i feel like this past person has been trying to pursue you but it's kind of feeling regret they're feeling regret of losing you they're feeling rejected now now that you know the tables have turned <clears throat> it feels capricorn like the tables have turned and now this person is trying to pursue you and offer you this but they're hesitant because they know they messed it all up and they feel like you're not interested and them coming towards you is giving you a headache okay like one at one point of time you're the one that was on their place and now they're on in your place and that makes you feel content because you finally got a revenge without actually taking revenge so this person got their karma for doing you for mistreating you <clears throat> So there is a new solid beginning in your career. I'm seeing there's a major sunshine, like you have massive money, massive riches, growth coming in with your work. I feel you need to learn, keep on learning, growing, and whatever your skill is. Say for example, you are a accountant. You may need to learn more, you know, in order to defeat the ones that are on your level right now. <clears throat> because you're getting those results you're in this position where you're putting your efforts into a direction and you're getting those results in return so this is the right time for you to put the efforts and learn in your field to grow in your field i'm seeing that is a good news regarding your work being appreciated major project or a lot of clients coming in there's growth coming in <clears throat> okay so landing a good project or something i'm seeing or uh, yeah i'm feeling you're embarking on a new career and that's going to that has a bright future for you so solid new start and solid new beginning a lot of prosperity and abundance but it comes when you're traveling it doesn't come when you're at home so nothing to do with something like home business it's something to do with more traveling i can call this as real estate or doing an artwork or an entrepreneurship or <clears throat> in your field of work like wherever you're just going to an office i'm seeing that's the kind of work where you're getting that kind of achievement that you're looking for okay but you will be facing you will be meeting different types of people okay there will be different types of situation where you need to come out of <clears throat> while moving towards your goal and you will learn lessons with a lot of different types of people in a lot of different situation that is a must thing okay so some of you buying a new car <clears throat> six of pentacles yeah your land you land sorry what am i saying you're landing a high opportunity you're landing a big opportunity in money there's a big opportunity in money coming in for you for sure capricorn yeah <clears throat> i feel like there was either a debt situation someone's going to pay off your debts uh pay off their debts to you or there's an inheritance money which i don't see this much but i feel there's a job opportunity that pays you a lot you're going to feel really happy with all the appreciation that people are going to shower you with your life is about to change 
you know, with the hustle that you're doing right now with yourself, your life will change. You're having the ability to manifest what you desire. Major manifestation. Libra Gemini Aquarius coming in. <clears throat> then we have Wheel of Fortune. So life is changing pretty fast. Yeah, your life is changing pretty fast. For good, everything you want is coming for you. Give your relationship a chance. Let your friends help you. You're going to meet someone new through your friend circle. Okay. And then we have passion. Initially, there will be a lot of dry passion. You might get intimate as well. But then I feel you guys will give each other a chance on a relationship. Taking this forward. <clears throat> After this intimacy, you guys are going to get deeply connected. So... Just pull out something else. So there is a hell lot of passion between you guys. Okay. Court house. Some of you I'm seeing is uh, you're dealing with a either this person is in law or you guys are thinking of shifting to a bigger house or a new house, which is happening for you. Someone who has taken your money, I feel like there's some sort of a court situation maybe taking place in your life or you know what the situation is. Things are changing for good. Okay, so the result is going to be in your favor right now. Well, the man, oh my gosh. I feel like uh, you have an expectation that you want someone that's wealthy, someone... Wealthy, see, being wealthy is not bad. It's not wrong. It's just an energy. It's another energy like love, which is a high vibrational energy. If you don't link greed around it, it's a beautiful energy. Okay, money is a beautiful energy. Love is a beautiful energy. If you don't, you know, in uh, <clears throat> involve greed or clinginess, desperation, then everything is good. Okay, because money brings you stability. And love brings you happiness and a reason to live. So I feel like this person is not just wealthy. They're also coming with a lot of love. And you have an expectation that someone gives you a life that's more stable. And if you're a man watching this, you want to give this life to someone that you're looking for. So either ways, I'm seeing the masculine over here is quite wealthy. It's going to become really, really wealthy here. Your life is rapidly moving forward from this chaotic situation of not being able to decide or being in this court related situation or the past. I feel like the past was a false person and they may have also, uh, you know, made situations so serious that you had to go to court for some of you. For some of you, it's like this person was never honest with you and was more about money and they, they used you for some personal reasons. So you're coming out of that chaotic situation, that mess, and changing your life for good. You want to change. You want someone that comes in, that sweeps you off your feet and like changes your whole life like a fairy tale, like something that happens in movies and stuff like that. So I feel that is happening here. Eight of Wands is a fast movement, this fast movement. I feel like, yes, as I was telling you, there's going to be an intimacy first between this and you uh, you between you and this person there's going to be an intimate bond okay take it however this resonates this might be too specific for some of you guys okay i'm not saying you should get intimate be before knowing the person that's something that you must never do but yes i feel somehow this could be too specific that you guys first may get too intimate and then take this forward in the form of a relationship and then decide to you know to live with each other Hmm. There will be a lot of talking, exchange of energy. I feel this person brings a lot of comfort in your life and you also bring a lot of comfort and happiness and stability and excitement in their life. So it's an equal give and take connection. I feel like this is a long term connection. This is not something that will be like there they will be an intimacy and then quickly this will uh, fade away this will end no i feel like it will move from there on it will grow from there on there's gonna be extreme cozy moments and you guys will be exchanging a lot of love and you know care for each other 
equal give and take here. So your expectations are actually becoming real. So there's a new beginning, a passionate new beginning with this person that's rich and wealthy. And if you're a masculine here, you're also very rich or becoming one. But I'm seeing the female is no less. The, the feminine is no less. The feminine is actually working on herself and becoming successful and more richer day by day. Okay, so everything happens in a mutual manner. If you're rich, you will attract someone rich. If you're... Um, if you have self-love, you'll attract someone that loves you. So everything is working here in a mutual manner. So yeah, six of cups. <clears throat> For some of you, it could be an age difference. Oh my gosh, this is what I was feeling. I feel like your past person is watching you, Capricorn. They're watching you and they're feeling alone without you. This person is missing you and might send you a message. Okay, but I feel like you won't reply them. You will or you will be having a cold reply to them. And honestly, you don't want this person anymore, the past person. Because now that you've found your comfort and peace within yourself, you're going solo. You really don't want to mess your head up with this person coming back. So you're done with this. But I feel like a past person is definitely missing you feeling alone. Maybe this is a Virgo. <clears throat> they want to send you a gift, flowers or a message and trying to fix it you know you're wanting to fix situation Ooh, shucks. okay you saw this person with someone else or you realize that they're in uh, dating someone else you ha you felt a shady you know vibe of this person so and it's something this person said to you that keeps on replaying in your mind which makes you feel like hating this person okay you might still be interested in them. For some of you, are still not over the past. However, this new person that's going to be wealthy is going to change your mind. Or the one that comes with a lot of love is going to change your mind real soon. <clears throat> the whole chapter in your life is changing. The moment you are like meeting this new person, you will stop replaying the past. Okay? Because you're still attract. You're healing. Right now, this is a period for you to heal Give off that negative energy and attract only the positive, okay? And this all starts from you only. I feel like, uh, <clears throat> I'll tell you later, a little later in this read, okay? So I feel like you've started to find happiness in being alone. You're not lonely, but you're alone right now. And you want to play solo for now because you don't want to be, you know, held up, take, uh, you know, being controlled by someone or waiting on something or someone for your happiness you want to take the lead and be in control of your happiness i feel like this is making you feel good because this alone period this lonely time is good for you you're healing and you're feeling good about yourself you're feeling happy you needed this <clears throat> sometimes you do feel like you want to fix things from the past but that that's something that is just you know that's not working out for you so you're moving towards happiness evolution is taking place in your life capricorn trust me on that there's major evolution taking place <clears throat> you want space you want to be left alone okay you want space the moment you've given this past person a space they're not able to find happiness they want you they're feeling lonely, but you've started to feel happy. This is not the person that you're vibing with. You have someone new. Or you've just met this wealthy person and things started to move forward in your life. Real quick. <clears throat> Fork in the road. I feel like there will be a situation where a lot of times you may feel like you're trying to build something. Okay, and then there's someone coming from the past ruining everything or trying to mess with your emotions or your mental state. So make sure that you don't allow anything like that happening. You're well prepared before time. And I'm also seeing when you're moving towards achieving your goals, you may have some road blockages coming in your way. So how do you deal with that? Ignore. Ignore. Ignorance is bliss sometimes. So I feel it's important that you ignore these people that are trying to get your attention to ruin your energy. Take as much rest and nap as you can because 
uh, your mind should be well rested in order to deal with the energy suckers. So close yourself off to these enemies so that they see you sleep in when they're reaching out to you when they're troubling you. Okay? Shine. It's time for you to rise and shine and you're going to get famous or there's a lot of money coming in there's a major project or a proposal coming in i feel this is the end of losing and you will move towards winning you've understand that now I have uh, lost something in my life and now i'm ready for this change where i'm only going to win you've started to listen instead of you know talk more sometimes you know we talk so much that we do we stop we we block our own intuition we don't listen to what our inner core is asking us for so you're being connected to your inner core and you're listening to your personal needs then looking outside for validation <clears throat> yeah. practice practice makes the man perfect some of you are practicing a new skill it will bring you a reward in the long run you might fail, but in the end of the day, you're winning. You're winning. For some of you, you guys are practicing on letting go. And I feel like 21 days of practice will definitely give you, uh, will build you this habit of ignoring. That doesn't suit you. That doesn't fit well with your goals or alignment. The people that you're leading or uh, the, sorry, the people that you have around you are really helpful, especially your friends, uh, close friends and family members are really helpful and they care for you. To be a cancer person that's really helpful and caring towards you. <clears throat> if you keep patience, you won't stay alone for a long time. Wait for a major opportunity to kick in. This is what I was telling you. I'll tell you later. Now let me see. What is a message for you here? Advice, please. Okay. Purification and detoxification. Right now, this alone time is important for you to detox yourself. You might need a gold uh, ring, okay, or a chain or an earring. You can wear that, okay? Right now, it's important for you to purify yourself from the pent-up energy, which is acting like a toxin, okay for you for your mental health for your physical health so that is why this alone time is a bliss for you where a lot is going to change in your life and by detoxifying purifying yourself up you're ready to embrace a new energy of white light and allowing yourself to dream in a clear manner and have a clear vision about your desires and get what you want so opportunities are coming for you <clears throat> have patience Capricorn, let's see the signs coming in. You have Libra. You have Sagittarius. You have Leo. So these are the three major signs you might meet, you might deal with. Now let's see Aries to Pisces, 15 to 21 Feb. Let's see their feelings and emotions towards you. Aries is keeping their options open, unsure about you. Taurus is cheating with someone else. <clears throat> Gemini is thinking about a solid new start, but is confused about your emotions or they're emotionally imbalanced right now. Cancer is seeing there's a ray of light with you. They feel like they want to have a new beginning. They want to start a new chapter with you where they can be your perfect mate. And then we have Leo. You might be dealing with a cancer strongly. Leo wants to marry you. Let's see you as a one. Virgo. <clears throat> Virgo is having a strong eye on you. But they want to play you, I feel. Then we have Libra. Libra is more about me, myself and I. You have to go by myself, my, my uh, ways. If not, buzz off. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. <clears throat> Scorpio. Scorpio is uh, watching you, wants to come towards you and offer you friendship. Deep friendship turning into love. If this is a friend, they want to take it forward. Sagittarius trying to manifest you. I feel like the Sagittarius is uh, really picky about things and they might not be the good a uh, suitable match for you they're always like stalking you being too possessive manipulative 
Capricorn, equal given. There's a lot of love here. They want to give you an offer of love. Aquarius, they're stuck on you. They may have someone else they need to let go of. Pisces is a big no-no for you. This person is a violent, aggressive male or female and will end up ruining your happiness. So this could be too specific. So make sure that you're aware of this thing. Now I'm going to pull out charms. So you're embarking on a new career and you're about to manifest it. And MN is also confirmation of manifestation. So your manifestation is taking place. Major manifestation is taking place. Someone's name letters have S, M, N, I. I'm seeing uh, this is the energy of money. So a lot of money coming in, guys. And I'm also seeing strawberries and aphrodisiac. So there's going to be a deep intimate connection between you and the one that you are attracting, that wealthy person. M, N is also talking about money. Okay. And this brings about a lot of comfort and stability in your life. And your uh, root chakra is going to become more strong when you have more money you feel more strong base chakra feels more strong uh, you might be taking a lot of strawberries th these days it makes you feel happy i'm also seeing this could be so many so many opportunities coming in uh, yeah someone's name starts from sim you know you can make it out yourself yeah so that's about it guys i hope you enjoyed it don't forget to raise the vibrations of this read by liking subscribing commenting and sharing i'll see you again please take care of yourself bye